So, I'm really sad. I lost Jeff and I lost my neighbor, Ronnie, one door over this week. And um, I used to borrow tools from Ronnie all the time. And every time he saw me, he drove like he was going to hit my truck, which used to annoy the shit out of me. But, you know, like, I never get to say ever again. We're not going to be sad about this, okay? Because we're energy and we never die. So, Jeff, did, he's he, he'll come around and visit me like all the other ghosts do, right? So, anyways, let me tell you about Jeff. It's, yeah, it. The first time Jeff ever went live, he had he was in my channel. I was doing the live stream the night that Jeff first set his channel up and went live, right? His uh his his, his veterans chat. Veterans US Veterans Chat was the channel. And when he was finally able to go live, he was actually in my live stream that night. Um yeah, and he would always say hello dear. Hello dear. I can hear him saying that every time I see it. Hello, dear. And um, I, I have his phone number in my phone. Yeah. Jeff Ellis. And he was my friend at some point in time. Um, we were both BTM. He had... What can you say about Jeff? Like... I don't, I, I can't say until the very end, and not recently, you know, me and Jeff have always been friendly, always been friendly. Yeah, like, he, I've been on the stream, and he's called me up, and he's like, hello, dear, how are you, Sparky? Yeah, like, he's done that more than once. That's not something that's only happened a couple of times, and, you know, he's Jeff, it's it's nice to have someone to talk to sometimes. And I used to always have to explain to people, I swear. This was my memory. This was the funniest thing that I get to share. Like, I'm not going to be sad. I'm worried about his mother. But I, I, we're energy. We never die. It was a beautiful day to go home. It was a beautiful day to go home. Like, where is it? Come and tell me where it is. Right? We believe. We believe that there's home. We believe when we leave this earth, when we leave this this existence and this life and this physical body, we believe we're going somewhere. We believe that. We're hardwired for it. Somebody needs to come tell me. I want to know. I want to know. Yeah, and I tried to get sad about it, and then I was like, no, don't do that. We're energy. We never die. Jeff's going to come around and see me sometimes. When he does, I'm going to let you know, too. But I just always remember. <laughs> I love. Hello, dear. Hello, dear. And Jeff went everywhere. Jeff went absolutely everywhere. I can't tell you how many times I've had to explain to everyone. Jeff is free to go wherever he wants to go, y'all. Jeff was over there. What Was Jeff over there talking smack about me? No, Jeff wasn't over there talking smack about me. Was Jeff over there talking smack about you? No, Jeff wasn't over there talking smack about you. Jeff goes everywhere. You don't have to worry about seeing... Hey, why were you there? I used to ask him, why were you there? Where'd you see him at? Who were you watching? Yeah, I love that. That is the one thing. All right, so, like, I've been telling you stories about my channel. DOA was my guy, and American Doofus channel, uh, Character Unlock Me. I love Barry. Yeah, Doofus Unlock Me. Character Unlock, Sparky Madness, BTM Sparky. Yeah, and then came BTM. And Jeff was in BTM. Man, I love Jeff. I love Jeff. Me and Jeff talked on the phone a bunch. Me and Jeff talked on the phone a bunch. I love Jeff. I can hear it right this second. Hello, dear. Hello, dear. Well, you know, Sparky. He gave great advice. I don't... Look, I don't know if he told Fisherman Sales. 
I don't know if he ever lied to me. I just know that I never had a problem with Jeff Ellis until all this pirate pedophilia stalking ass shit started. And he got tangled up with them. He got tangled up with with a, a pirate pedophilia stalking cult. He did. I've spent a lot of time on the phone with Jeff Ellis. I've, Jeff Ellis has been in my channel a lot. I've known Jeff Ellis since the days of BTM. And I'm really glad to be able to sit here and tell you with a smile on my face. Jeff Ellis can go anywhere Jeff Ellis wants to go. And if he wants to come hang out with Sparky Madness, he can come hang out with Sparky Madness. And did you see him talking shit about me when you saw him in that other place? That you really don't want anybody else to know you were there? <laughs> you didn't. I love that. Isn't that beautiful? That's beautiful. I love Jeff Ellis. Jeff's gonna come see me. We never die, y'all. We are energy. I don't know how to explain it any more simply. But I'm really glad that Jeff Ellis was my friend. He was my friend. I, Jeff Ellis, it doesn't matter what you thought about him. Jeff Ellis was a friend to me. Jeff Ellis has called me and been like, hello, dear. And fixed everything in that moment just because he reached out and called me. So, we Jeff Ellis left this world this week but Jeff Ellis didn't leave Sparky Madness because Jeff Ellis was my friend while he was here and we're the same energy in the universe and I'm going to see Jeff Ellis again I am I love you so much I'm going to see you soon